I don't beat the box. Oi! Uh, uh, episode 6. Begin. Commence. Fargo, listen. It may not be a good idea to go visit Pleasures for a while, if you know what I mean. Yeah, Castacia's probably pretty pissed. I just hope she realizes it's for the best someday. That's one way of putting it. Listen. Are you sure there aren't any other women out there that are more to your liking? Oh, come on. You sound like my mom. Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> I <sighs> drank my water in the wrong blowhole. I'm a dolphin. Anyway, Kalim, we ready to head out? Uh-huh. Sure. Yeah. Let's get this party started. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm pretty two-faced. Well, Kalisha's not two-faced. Let's go visit Pleasures. I uh, don't you'd want to see me anytime soon. I feel ya. Uh, hmm. We have to somehow get Quinta back because she's my girlfriend. Let us go to the pub. Let us go to the... Go to the... To Selga's pub. No. Da 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 You probably don't have any weapons. You probably don't have any weapons is what I thought, but you actually do. What? Your attack is 61. What? Is this? Is this an I? Tom store. This is probably pretty similar to an item store. Glitch fairy. It's. Yeah, it's the glitch fairy. He's in here at the item store. Glitch fairy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Glitch fairy. Yeah. Feel free to look around, but please don't go upstairs. Would you like to purchase anything? Actually, I heard from Helga that you were looking for someone to do a job for you. Oh. As in, work part time. No. As in, a hunting job, a hunter. Oh, yes. Helga did mention a hunter friend of hers. You must be him. You are correct, Miss Smith. Kill him, Knox. As long as you don't ask for murder, I am at your service, Knox. Thank you, and if it turns out I do take you for another's life, don't worry, I'm sure Helga knows an assassin or two. Why did the music stop? That I do. You do not know what you want me to hunt, do. That's all I know that rhymes with do at the top of my head, no. Many years ago. Oh, this is getting deep. Uh, she's a woman. Hmm. Many years ago. That's not a woman. Many years ago. Oh, I just pressed space. But someone's on Frost Mountain or something. I know of those berries before I was old enough to fully live off in nature. I sold them to potion shops. They fetch quite a bit of gold. Yes, they're quite hard to come by and they are used in making some of the more powerful potions. My who's a bond? Sorry, excuse me. Benjamin wanted to save time and money by collecting them himself. He never returned. My condolences. I'm sorry. Even to this day, I still weep for him. Losing loved ones is hard. Ever since the day I knew in my heart he was dead, I haven't had the courage to sleep in our bed upstairs. Oh, spirits above, I miss him. I'm sorry. I thought I was ready to talk about Benjamin again. No, I, I understand. I'm assuming my job has something to do with him. Yes. Find it. Find the monster that killed Benjamin and bring me back its head. Monster, human, one of those drow scum. I don't care. I want it dead. Seems a bit extreme. What if your husband froze to death? You didn't know my Benjamin. 
He always went prepared. He must have had three pairs of long underwear on when he left here. It was murder, and I know it. Very well. If it's a monster that killed him, I will bring back its remains. But if it's human or drow, what do I do? I will not have that blood on my hands. Just find out and who did it, and I come back to me. I will hire an assassin if I have to. Will I still receive pay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So will you help me? Yeah. Why, why not? Thank you. Cool. Mm -hmm. Frostcap Summit. I hope I'm close to that. Or I have a map. Do I have a map? <sighs> Fuck. I don't have a map. Damn it. Uh. Do you have a job for me, bro? No. He does not. That guy has like a really fat face. It's kind of cool. Don't judge me. I, I find weird things cool. You think this guy, uh. Whoops, that was not an arrow key. You think this guy is scared? Random people. <laughs> uh, I think I already read that before. But it's kind of funny because he's staring at the uh, strip club. It's more like a prostitute club. Sex club. Sex? Sess? I don't know what I just said. Hmm. I have not visited the weapon shop yet. I'm assuming there is a weapon shop. Also, I have not checked my sound quality in... Uh, what episode is this? Six? In three episodes, so... Uh, I'm sorry. Ooh, I like your hair. Sup, punk? Helga informed me that you have a job that needs doing. Oh, awesome. You're interested, right? Perhaps. What do you want done? Easy. It's a piece of cake. Sorry, I had a burp, but I wanted to not make it loud this time. I just... Fuck. Don't you have a fighting dummy you can practice on? Yeah, well, it's not the same. A dummy can't offer feedback, and you have to fix them up after you break them in half. I want a challenge, yo. Can I get you on my party? Because I like, I like you. You're cool. So how about it? Can I test my axe out in combat with you? Yeah! Let's get this party started! Um... She wants to test uh, your axe out, right? So I don't understand why I would fight her. I'm going for the uh, Undertale run. Wow, that's a strong axe. I can't let that happen again. You're going down! Pow! Helga. Wait, Kalim. Pow. Helga. Pow. Ooh. Tackle. Nice. Uh, oh, shoot. This is Fargo. He's got a lot of stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh. <laughs> Whoops. Ooh, chill. You need a chill, girl. That was so weak. I like your axe. That's a really cool uh, looking. Sorry. Excuse me. Strong attack. 
wasn't very strong, if you ask me. Helga, just, uh, dude, that's so good. Double attack? Dude. Okay, fire is a little bit more effective. Uh-huh. What about Smith? Dude. Berserker's Necklace, Power Ointment. Now level 13, a level 11, with Armor Break, that sounds good. <sighs> Woo! That was the best fight I've had in ages. You're welcome. Now, about my payment. Don't, don't worry, I haven't forgotten. Besides, you deserve it. Oh, shoot, 3,000 gold obtained. Rune Blade? <gasps> it's like RuneScape! A sword! Hey, come on. Don't underestimate yourself, pal. A guy of your strength deserves a bonus. Thank you for your generosity and noticing my sick strength. Pew, pew. That's the noise of my guns, aka my arms. Pew, pew. Flexing. Yeah, strength. A friendly brawl. Hmm. Um. Uh-uh. Why did I just do that? For some reason, I felt the need to put my water bottle lid in my mouth, and it was awkward. Hey, it's my favorite combat buddy. Combat buddy? You know what? I'll let you browse the special stuff. You're that awesome. Dang, dude. We're getting married. Nope, we're not. But me and her are totally gonna become a thing. I like her hair. Fargo, you can use this sword too, huh? I need, I need uh, the mithril claw. Yeah. A defensive claw and an offensive claw. It's probably very good to have both. However, I can't afford both. Um, oh no. That's not much for a Maiwa Moshinduru. Um, 50. 3,000. 7,000. Necklace. Powers. Uh, hmm. Key items, huh? I think I should know what where those go. I probably uh, I'm just stupid. Okay, Helga, did I get you? Yeah, I did. Your defense goes down, but your attack goes up. That's pretty good. Uh huh. Fargo. Oops. Fargo. Equip this Mithral sword. Okay, goodbye, lady. You're my favorite. You're my favorite. Just, just so we're clear. I like you more than the armor guy, and the pleasure guy, and the elixir gal. Uh, because you say yo, and I like your hair, and you say yo. I like the way you talk. That is it. I gotta find Frostbite Summit. Ah! 14 minutes. Doing pretty good. Hmm. I don't know. There's something at Orchid Village. This is the developer camp, right? Um, right? Cherry Samba lives here. Right in here. Hmm. 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 That's all I got to say. I'm very, uh. This is Cherry Samba? Uh, like a quest? Hmm, nope. Sorry, buddy. 
Unless you plan on joining us on a journey to rid the world of Suez, I'm afraid there's nothing you can help us with. Okay, maybe this is not... The developer cam. I'm sorry for intruding. Intru hmm, 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 hmm. I almost had an actual English word. And that's very impressive for me. I just realized I'm constantly playing on on what you guys would be watching and not on my actual game. Because my keyboard, I guess, is like dead. Uh, I remember this lady. Hey. Hey! Oh, God. No, I, I remember this lady. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> oh no. Oh god, no. Uh, yup. Sure do. Say, you're not mad about the whole. Vivian, we barely knew each other. You don't have to feel bad about breaking off the engagement. Oh, whew, I was worried for a second there. Hey, now I think about it, would you? like to come to our wedding. Laz is going to be wearing dad's old tux and boy does he look smart in it. No, thank you. I'll pass. Oh, okay. Just making sure. I don't really actually... <gasps> you say this every time. Magazine so dirty that all those who gaze inside are rendered speechless. You open the first page, and the first thing you see now I couldn't think of something creative to say that wasn't dirt, literal dirt. So I'm sorry, I failed you guys. I failed at being funny. Uh, my curse, my only weakness, unfunniness. Um, you are the scum of the world. Is what she sounds like. What did I do now? How dare you leave my little Vivi in the hands of some incompetent nerd? Uh, what's wrong with nerds? Jesus, what the? Everything's wrong with nerds, especially that one. It's pretty early, I don't know if I feel like actually screaming. Not only does he spend his days with a nose in a book, but for heaven's sake he used to be a lizard! My Vivi, marrying a lizard! I don't hear of it. How does this make me the scum of the world? Weren't you lis- Oh god! I am burping a lot, so I made some teriyaki, uh, chicken. And I, I drank two waters. So that's probably it. Because of you, my Vivi's now getting hitched to a lizard. Even you were a more suitable groom than that loser. I'll take that as a backhanded compliment. Now can I buy something or not? See? See? You're even more to the point than he is. Everything about that dork reeks of inadequacy. That's nice. But I didn't come here get lectured on Lazarus's faults I came here to buy. <laughs> Fine. Here's what I got. Holy crap. Why was I buy you have... You're so much better of a shopkeeper than the cool girl. And you have another Omaya Wamoshinderu. And another one. But this one's even more Amaya Wamoshin to do. This one's like got Nani written twice in a row. I want it. 35,000. Holy crap, you have literally everything. Good? Good. Now get out of my face, you horrible man. 
Is Quinta still over here at uh, the down here? Quinta? No. Quinta, are you in this house? I don't like the. I don't like this song. I think I would get sick of this song very, very easily. Is this my house? I have a nice house. Bum bum bum. Oh god, this I can't wait for the revamp because the revamp is gonna have its own original soundtrack. That's right, original soundtrack. Think it, picture it, believe it. Original soundtrack. No more of this. It'll be more like. This, but with originality, and I would that's not what I want to do, and I would probably still get really sick of it. Laz, you want to join my team again? What can I do you for your son? Son, Vivian doesn't want to marry me anymore. Still, in the short time you spent here, you really felt like family. I like his mustache, mustache. Don't mind me, just getting a little emotional. I noticed. Anyway, my boy, you must have some reason for coming here. What can I do for you? I was wondering if there are any jobs you can do around town. Are you a priest? Mm, no, I'm a hunter. And I'm afraid that there's nothing you can help out with after all. You could check with Frankfurt if you're desperate, but... Ah, alright. Very much so desperate. Hey, Laz. Was that a spider? Nope. Just a fly. Um Good day, Laz. Oh god. Uh, I agree with Sylvia. I forgot what he looked like. This is a nerd to the T. Uh, it's you again. You sound bitter. <laughs> no. Really? I have no reason to be bitter. I'm, like, I maybe had a better voice before, but this is just sad. I don't know. Towards you, I didn't think Vivian was all that bad. I'm gonna try my keyboard again. No, it's not that. Well, she's all right, I guess, but she is prettier now that I'm human again and all. But <sighs> but. Sure, this is the easy way out of my 2,500 gold debt, but marriage? It's a lifelong commitment. There's always divorce, you know. Yeah, because it's a good idea to divorce the daughter of one of Fort Mud Pond's ex-torturers. Point taken. I don't know, Knox. What should I do? This is... Um, see, see, uh, so, I don't think he actually likes her, so I would say don't marry her, but I am also thinking out for myself, and if he doesn't marry her, I might have to, so you should marry her, definitely, yes, good person, and you'll grow to love her, yeah, I guess. It's just... Wait. How do I know that you're not just saying that to get out of marrying her yourself? <gasps> He's a genius! Oh my god! Lazarus! How did you know? I mean, no. She, she's more interested in you than she is in me, and Miss Albino Hunter doesn't have the same ring to it. Should have waited for the next animalist hunter to come along. Oh, oh yeah, animalist because you can speak to lizards. Boom, boom, boom. Mm -hmm. 
Wait, hold on. I think I just missed out on getting him in my party. It's just something something felt wrong. Don't marry her, and you shouldn't marry someone you don't want to. Huh? Thought you wanted me to marry Vivian. What a change of heart. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't love her. No change of heart. It's your life. If you don't want to marry her, then don't. What about Vivian's dad? You'll kill me if I break his little girl's heart. You might be more understanding if you pay back what you owe them. How? I don't have the money. Uh, I could pay it for you. I have some extra cash. Really? You do that? Of course, just pay me back later. Yeah, no, not gonna happen. What was that? Nothing. Just give me the cash. Well, what do you know? I don't have 2,500 on me. What? You gotta be kidding me. Enjoy your wedding. Have, hope you have fun raising a family with Vivian. Uh uh. No. Mm mm. No. Mm mm. He might be a dork, but he's. he's my pal. And if I need to make some quick cash to make sure my pal is good and gu Gucci, then I'm going to do exactly that. So I'm going to go into this place with the girl that hates him. Well, that was not worth anything. Can't sell that. Uh huh. I'm gonna make you very proud, Sylvia. I'm going to make you extremely proud. You don't know that you just gave me the money that I needed. Dun, 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 dun. Good day, Lazarus. Is there a way to skip? Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Don't marry her. Uh huh. Mm, no change of heart. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh. I'll pay it for you. Uh huh. I have extra cash. You do, uh, yeah, I do it. Not gonna pay you back. What was that? Nothing. Just give me the cash. Here you go. Wow, thanks, Knox. You're a lifesaver. I wouldn't count this as saving your life per se, but you're welcome. Okay. Now time to talk to Salvador. The price of freedom. Right, it takes time to build up the courage for something like this. Hey, Salvador, hey, what's it going? Hey, hey. Yes, cool. Thanks, Salvador. I'm gonna just go ahead and take my leave. We're at 29 minutes and I say Lazarus, let's check this house before I end it. Yeah, this is a bald guy, his name is Frankfurt. Yar, how be the wind in your sails? I don't own a boat. That be no excuse. Ah, silly Frankfurt, whatever. I might as well be off now. Not so fast. I refuse to accept this. I'm sorry. Who are you? Obsidian Sickle. That's awesome name. S uh, sorta. Not for a, an actual name. Uh, I'm Queen Dud and Vargo's right. Oh, uh -huh. Why do I keep clapping? I'm sorry. What? 
Speaking of which, Cherry Sama wrote you incredibly out of character. You would never let Quinta out of your sight. As for you, Frankfurt, we're going to have to do something about you. Now, aren't we? Yar. Excuse me, but why would any sane woman want to have anything to do with Frankfurt? The odd? I'm a writer, dang it, and a much more competent one than Cherry Sama, I might add. Dude, am I getting in the middle of a feud between Obsidian Sickle and Cherry Dash Sama? And I find it absolutely atrocious that she didn't end up using a character with so much potential as Frankfurt here. And dare I even ask as to what the percent hashtag number sign, whatever you want to call it, dollar sign at you're talking about? Like, look at him. What does Cherry Sama use him for? Apart from Vivian not wanting to marry him, absolutely nothing. I won't stand for it. I won't let him be just some red herring. No. Frankfurt the Odd will have purpose, even if to make one for him. I like how Obsidian Sickle looks. Frankfurt's Odd. Can't you just leave it at that? Oh, God! She's got fire in her eyes! I wish I could scream, but I can't. So I'm gonna do it very quietly. Never. I like the music. Oh, well that was fast, huh? That's uh, awkward. Now, Frankfurt, let's get you a wife, shall we? As long as I don't have to gut the cucumber. Oh no, of course not. Why get Frankfurt a wife of all things? I'm a hopeless romantic. What can I say? I cannot believe this is happening. If you're a hopeless romantic, can, uh, can Quinta be my girlfriend, please? Please and thank you. What do you have? I see. So now, although you have the power of of video games and development on your side, you want me to help you find he a wife. And that's going to be it for this episode. I'll see you in the next one. I won't actually see you, and hopefully you'll see me. Uh-huh. Goodbye. Peace.